Yo, what up? It's We Make Best, here for another guide for every deck in Classic Constructed, and today it's Dorinthia. Dorinthia is a warrior that wants to use attack reactions to make blocking as awkward as possible to push through damage and build counters on her weapon, Dawnblade. Dorinthia's core equipment is Crown of Providence, Courage of Bladehold, Rayforge Braces, Refraction Bolters, and most importantly, Dawnblade. Courage of Bladehold is a very powerful piece of equipment. On top of being able to block for two, it also makes your Dawnblade attacks cost zero for an entire turn, allowing you to use your resources on key cards instead. Some of the strongest turns can be done when using this piece of equipment. Dorinthia's key cards are Steelblade Supremacy, Glistening Steelblade, and Singing Steelblade. Steelblade Supremacy will allow you to draw cards that give your Dawnblade go again, allowing you to attack an additional time this turn, letting you threaten even more card draw and potentially OTK your opponent. Glistening Steelblade allows you to stack counters on Dawnblade, making it near impossible for the opponent to block future turns because of how efficient it becomes, only costing one resource to attack. Singing Steelblade is the best attack reaction card because it makes it impossible for the opponent to block correctly as you can tutor for any attack reaction card that pushes through their block. The most common attack reaction cards you will find in Dorinthia decks are Iron Song Response, Route, Overpower, Stroke of Foresight, and Out for Blood. Dorinthia's hero ability and Twinning Blade allow her to attack multiple times to threaten those key on hits repeatedly all in a single turn. Dorinthia also has many ways to give Dawnblade go again with cards like Glint of the Quicksilver, Run Through, Warrior's Valor, Spoils of War, and Refraction Bolters. Some of the strengths of Dorinthia are, Dorinthia is one of the fastest decks in the format. If just one of her key cards lands a single on-hit effect, it allows her to race even some of the most aggressive decks in the format. Dorinthia being a warrior, she has access to the best blocking equipment in the game. This coupled with the fact that all of her cards block for three makes her surprisingly good at blocking. Dorinthia can abuse some of the most powerful attack action cards such as Command and Conquer and Enlighten Strike. This is done by forcing the opponent to overblock on her weapon attacks only to follow up with a punishing attack action. Dorinthia's main weakness is defense reactions, giving an even playing field to your opponents who come prepared. Defense reactions give your opponent the ability to react to your attack reactions at instant speed. Defense reactions such as Sink Below, Fate for Scene, Unmovable can counter most of your attack reactions. Defense reactions can be played from Arsenal, denying your reprise trigger, making it hard for Dorinthia to push over the top. Aside from the standard Dawnblade Dorinthia list, you can run Hatchet of Body and Hatchet of Mind with the aim to abuse the powerful card, Spill Blood. Although running this version denies you access to some powerful cards such as Glistening Steel Blade, Twinning Blade, and Run Through, as they are unable to target axes. Thanks for tuning in for the Dorinthia Quick Guide. Let us know what you want to see next. Boom!